Hey guys, welcome to part 3 of Razor C tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can set up a template. Now, I'm, I've just downloaded a template from template.org and I chose this one. Download and extract it and then once you've extracted it, copy the template and paste it and you want to paste it into RC layouts. Paste, then copy the index.html file Sorry, no. I'm supposed to copy that. Copy, and then paste it into RC layouts. Then rename the index.html file to underscore RC and the name of the template. And then the extension is CSHTML. Then double click it, and then remove this. This is at. That's because. Uh, razor syntax starts with at and it's going to confuse it since that is not a command. Now, next, I'm going to put a few commands in so I'll follow along and then I'll explain what I did. Put at page dot m title, then here, this is keywords, put at page dot m m keywords. Now it's important to get the right casing otherwise it will not work. Right next put at page dot m description and then we want to link the style sheet which was we put at then href open bracket and oops then open bracket quotation mark put that symbol forward slash rc layouts forward slash and it's a style.css then close that and put a quotation mark then next just before that head closing tag put at render section quotation mark head then this div logo delete the content because we only want the div tag put at render section RC top comma false. Now we're going to do this several times. Now for the navigation bar, it's a bit different. So what you want to put here is at RC helpers dot simple menu, and then for sidebar one. Here, yeah, this is a left sidebar, so delete everything and we only, we only want the div tag so I put that and change it to RC left then same for sidebar 2 and that's on the right so that's going to be RC right so I put right and then for content it's going to be the main content that's going to be in the middle so I delete all these div tags and put at render body then copy that and you put rc bottom then where it says div id footer I don't need none of this so I'm going to delete that all the way down until there I think that should be right Ho hopefully I've not messed you up and where it says your site name instead of putting the year 2012 we're gonna write at date time dot now dot year this is because it'll get the uh, year automatically from the server okay next you wanna go to RC templates body and copy one of these templates then copy and paste it back in back into our uh, body and then rename it to RC nameless geometry dot CS HTML and that's it and then run the website in the browser and go to the admin go to the admin dashboard and 
once you go there go to show pages go to default and click edit and where it says layout click on the layout that we just made update and let's view the website and we've got a problem okay head okay just miss that now refresh and we've got another problem and yep like I said casing does matter and we've got another problem now as well yep I forgot the name of the folder and we're done okay there you go it's done it we've made our template now what I did now this part is a logo which is div id logo and we've rendered other content into it then we've got the navigation bar which we've rendered rc helpers simple menu then we've got content content left rc left which is there's nothing there then same with the right rc right and here we have these widgets this is the render body this is the main content now so it was pretty easy to set up we've got the year there which was that and then you've got render section head which is a top part and then these are just uh, meta keywords and description and that's the page title and the page title is currently that since we don't have we haven't sorted it out and in the next tutorial I will show you how you can edit the pages make new pages and make new widgets so see you there